Hello everyone, I am Devanshi Thakur from Seva Sadhan Saksham School, Nagpur. Our topic is Solution for Solid Waste Pollution. Waste segregation refers to sorting and separation of various waste types to facilitate recycling and correct onward disposal. Today, in this busy world, waste segregation is ignored due to the number of tasks that the people have to do. Improper segregation leads to pollution, which results in climatic change. As a solution to this problem, we have created this model of smart paint under the able guidance of our principal, Mrs. Padmasandra Kirna and science teacher, Mrs. Ritu Sharma Ma. Now, Master Ajun Kedar will explain the working of the smart segregator. This model is constructed upon an Arduino Uno microcontroller cooler in which we have calibrated various components to form an automatic dry and wet waste segregator. In this model, we have touch sensor, moisture sensor, servo motor, and Arduino. First of all, if some waste is kept on touch sensor, it will detect its touch and give the output value in 0 and 1, where one means there is something in contact with the sensor. If the output value is 1, further moisture sensor will detect the moisture value of substance and give the output value in between the parameters of 0 and 1023 where 0 means completely wet and 1023 means completely dry. If the moisture value of substance is lower than 1000, it will be wet substance and if it is greater than 1000, it will be dry substance. Once this is done, moisture sensor will pass the signal to servo motor and servo motor will move in either directions depending upon its dry weight or wet waste and in this way it will segregate dry and wet waste. We have this is the circuit of our model. Here we have Arduino, servo motor, touch sensor and moisture sensor. Now I am in a green tree and keeping it here. Now as you can see it is falling into bed bin because the touch sensor detected its touch and the moisture sensor uh, has detected its moisture value lower than 1000 that's why it has gone into wet bin. Now we have taken a rubber and we will keep it here. The touch sensor will detect its touch and moisture sensor will detect its moisture value and decide whether it is dry or wet waste. Now I have keep it here. Now let's see what will happen. As you can see it has gone into a dry bin so the moisture sensor has classified it as a dry bin. And this is how our model will work. Our smart bin is very useful. It can conveniently be used at homes, offices and other public places. It is cheap and durable. It also helps us achieve many sustainable goals. One of the main purpose of our bin is sorting of wet and dry waste. This ensures the cleanliness of the environment and prevention of diseases. This helps us achieve the sustainable goals of good health and well-being of our citizens and sustainable cities and communities. Sometimes, when the waste is not segregated, it is burned. This causes the greenhouse effect in the atmosphere and leads to global warming. Our wind also helps in reducing this action of climate change. This was a small effort from our side to keep the environment clean. Thank you.